In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to create a Google Drive account in 2025. This will only take about five minutes, and by the end of our time together, you'll have a shiny new Google Drive account ready to go. Let's dive in. First things first, begin by opening up your preferred web browser. In the search bar, type in Google Drive and hit the Enter key. You're now on your way to accessing one of the most popular cloud storage services available, offering a convenient way to store files and collaborate with others. Once your results have loaded, look for the link that reads drive.google.com and click on it. This will take you directly to the Google Drive homepage. Here, you have the chance to explore all that Google Drive has to offer, but right now our focus is on setting up your new account. On the Google Drive homepage, you'll need to find and click on the option that says use another account. This might be a bit of a surprise, especially if you haven't set up a Google account before, but don't worry, it's simple. Clicking this ensures that you can create a brand new account, free of any prior connections. Now you'll be taken to a page that prompts you to sign in. Here, look for the link that says create account and click on it. You'll see several options and it's important that you select for my personal use. This tells Google that you're setting up an individual account, perfect for personal use rather than something business related. Moving forward, you'll arrive on a page asking for your first and last name. Go ahead and fill in these fields with your personal information. Remember, this is the name associated with your Google account, so be accurate. Once that's done, click on next to continue. The following screen will request your birthday and gender. This information helps Google set up your account appropriately. Enter your birthday and select your gender before hitting next again. Each step brings you closer to accessing your new account. So let's keep going. Now you'll be prompted to choose a Gmail address. This is an important step as it becomes the primary way people can reach you through Google services. You can either pick from the available options or create a unique custom address. Be sure to choose something memorable. Once you've settled on an address, click next. And that concludes our journey to set up a Google Drive account in just a few easy steps. You've successfully created your account and you're now ready to explore the countless features Google Drive offers, from uploading and sharing documents to collaborating with friends and colleagues in real time. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and that you're as excited as I am about all the possibilities your new Google Drive account will bring. If you have any questions or run into any issues, feel free to reach out. Thanks for watching and see you next time.